As a non-governmental organization with a special focus on youth development, the strategy for mentoring initiative and leadership SMILE has continued to strive to inspire youth to discover and maximize their potentials by supporting them in their pursuit of purpose through seminars, networking, and personal development. One of such seminars was recently organized at Mende Senior High School, Maryland, with the theme as Aspire for greatness. When you want to achieve success, you will have that of criticism dwelling towards you. But because you have the greater picture of who you want to be, because you have what is called the vision. The students were sensitized and motivated on the importance of facing life's challenges with the purpose of overcoming them. Now, this is a story for you. No more. I mean, some people are born into very rich family, while some other are born into very poor family. Now, some of us, and we are here, we can have one opportunity or the other. And I want to tell you that we have to be careful of the opportunity we have, because the opportunity to come to us. There is a family in my house that the father um, used to buy books for his children. But uh, quite unfortunately that the children are not serious. I'll go into their room without telling them to if I told them to go let me. I'll go into their room, I'll play the books and I will wait. Then they go to the time I realize I can't continue like this. I need to get books of my own. What if they are here? Did the father told them to get it? What will I do with them? The president smiled when this senior high school, Samuel Afolayo, in an interview with Education Report on TV, spoke on the idea behind the event. This program, is we took it as a team titled Aspire for Greatness. It was organized by the chain champions of Mende Senior High School, partnering with SMILE, the organization. SMILE is a non-governmental organization to empower students, teach them and the youth, know, make them understand their goals, their vision, help them to break records and help them never to give up. Then we organized this program partnering with our teachers and our, our principal, the TGPS of District 2 and SMILE. Omolola Adebayo also spoke on the benefits of the program and how it has touched our life positively. This program has really inspired me in my confidence. You can see that I can talk confidently and boldly, even to address thousands of crowd. This program has also given me um, self-esteem, that's high self-esteem. I can make decisions on my own, no matter even I have a challenge that I'm facing. I can still overcome the challenges and also address people no matter what I'm facing. And also this program has even given me the inspiration to mentor people, even notwithstanding what the person is facing. I can talk to the person even if I've not known the person before. I can just come and address the person and start a discussion with the person. And also the person will be ready to listen to me because I'm ready to offer something to the person. The principal of the school, Mr. Joseph Fatok, stated that students should learn to develop themselves to become responsible citizens in the future. My school is one of the leading schools that is deeply involved in the SMILE activities. I'm happy with the state government, thanking the governor, thanking the commissioner, for allowing such a thing to happen in my school. The life of my students here has been turned around. They don't have to rely solely on parents alone. The talent, the inborn characteristics, the natural tendency in them, they now realize they are loaded with God's ability. And this they can transform and make themselves great. All said, mentoring and leadership empowerment remains the most powerful tools to positively impact the next generation of leaders and with the strategy for mentoring initiative and leadership guiding, inspiring and encouraging these youths, no doubt they will have a brighter, rewarding future.